Hello there. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create a localhost aliases and uh, how to work it through NetBeans. If we open, first of all let's enable our local server. And you should find it in here. Uh, now the server is on. Let's create a new project in Symfony using NetBeans. New project. We'll leave it be a PHP application. Next, we'll call the project my localhost. Localhost. And next, uh, local website. So the, uh, this is will be our URL for the project. Next, we do it in Symfony 2, and we click finish. If you watch the uh, uh, previous uh, video, we are using Symfony 2.3.20. So this is the most and the longest supported. Uh, Symfony 2.3 is the longest supported version of Symfony that we are using in here. So we are waiting for the unpacking of the package uh, to our local uh, in our local computer. shouldn't take long but because I have other application open open in the background so that's why it is a bit slow now it's done let's now to know the uh, the folder where your project is located at in your computer uh, basically you go to files project properties and here yeah, this uh, well, basically they are the same folder. The project folder and the source folder are in the same place. So now we go to a battery. A battery. And we go to aliases directories and we add a new app alias so we will call it uh, my local host and the location of the server unfortunately you can't uh, copy and paste in this interface because it's a basic command line we will type the folder that we want our directory to be hosted in so it will be but bear in mind we don't what we want basically the web a directory so we will type it like that so see users so fine document net beans project my local host and then web why web? Because it's a subdirectory in the uh, in the project folder. That's where we want our domain to point. This is our entry, and we click enter. Now the alias is is created. Uh, here it is, the web root of our directory. This is the web root that you will be dealing with. And we press enter to exit. Now we have that, and let's see. Uh, here will be handy because it's on our local server. We will tell uh, NetBeans where to look. So we, it's an app dev 
dot bhp this is our index folder so we tell in netbees to, to to focus in this because not, the, the website is not yet uh, in the open so this is the safest and the most secure environment to develop applications and not to be viewed online and we click ok now if we click now here you go congratulations you have successfully installed a new symphony application uh, this is the start in the next tutorial I hope I will show you how to create your first function and how to basically how to create pages and to make it a web application now so far we if you see this you are basically you have this is will be in the real website this is will be the domain name so the domain name is pointing at the web directory and the web directory is the main entry to our application I hope that helps thanks for watching